The waters of Pearl Harbor were a welcome sight for many of the crew on the guided missile cruiser USS Port Royal. And the ship was a welcome sight for many family and friends. Well, I, I felt amazed. Uh, it, one thing to think about it when you're coming home, but it's another feeling when you actually see them. Uh, it feels great. Uh, it's been a long time coming. Uh, been in contact with my family throughout the deployment, but uh, it's just a sight to see them. And it's pretty emotional. So uh, we, we, we're glad to be back home. Welcome back. Navy Region Hawaii Commander Rear Admiral Frank Pons welcomed the crew home from its eight-month deployment. Port Royal was the last ship to lead Commander Task Force Iraqi Maritime and helped transition the defending of Iraqi territorial waters to the new democracy's sailors and marines. I'd say the highlight of this voyage was just watching the growth from the crew. It came from, uh, from a brand new crew, essentially, to a well-seasoned uh, team of professionals, and they really did great. The Port Royal has a crew of more than 300 officers and enlisted personnel. These sailors will now enjoy some R&R &R after helping maintain the security in the Middle East for the better part of a year. Tech Sergeant Michael Jackson, Joint Base Pearl Harbor-Hickam, Hawaii.